The Kelvin Hall project's really quite unique. Um, we think it's the only facility of its kind in the world. Um, it brings together sports and leisure facilities with heritage stores and facilities for accessing um, heritage material too. So it's really quite unusual. Um, and within that we have the National Library of Scotland facilities which are led digitally um, and focus on the moving image collections. This was the first time the, the Moving Image Archive collection had been in a public space, so we weren't sure how uh, people would interact with it, what they would expect from it. We wanted to have a really interactive experience for visitors coming in. Um, we wanted it to be a communal experience as well, so that people could share that, um, could sit next to each other and look at our collections. Um, they could talk about them as well. That was at the heart of this development, I think, was to provide material that was you know, really prompt discussion and reminiscence, nostalgia. In terms of access, a touchscreen is bringing in audiences, particularly young children are showing their parents, they're showing their grandparents how to interact with it. I think that's something quite magical about touchscreen technology now is that um, you know we can have people who are pensioners and we can have them you know with their great grandchildren looking at the material together and they both feel that they have something that they can share. It's very straightforward and um, people seem to dive straight in there. I think also because it's so visual um, that's what attracts people to it. One of the reasons we selected Popcoms was they had a clear understanding of our brief and they also exhibited a, a certain excitement about our, our project. And we were also impressed with their um, ability in designing uh, beautiful applications as we saw from some of their other case studies. Um, they uh, were well engaged with us. We had regular meetings and we talked through the whole process. We saw all the designs early on and talked through um, uh, what one was right for our, our requirement. And it was a very in, enjoyable and practical experience working, working with them. I think that the curated interface has really exceeded our expectations in terms of how the public have responded to it. It's been a very positive response and we really do get people of all ages using the interface. The best thing with the curated app at the moment is seeing a group around it with the headphones on, giggling away, talking at the top of their voices about memories that they're having connected to the footage. And that's when we realise that's what we're here for. I, I think the final curated interface experience is, is wonderful. It absolutely delivers on our requirement. It looks beautiful, it's beautifully designed. And I see our visitors sitting here in the comfy sofas, watching it enthralled with the, the material, which is exactly what we wanted to see.